guys. So I'm gonna show you guys some very um 100% real um rainmaker tips and stuff to you too. These are 100% real. Try them out. So the first one is to only use the bamboo sword because a real weapon in the game is complete rubbish. Like all of these weapons are rubbish except for this one. This is the only good weapon. It is the best weapon in the game. Um, you especially don't want to use something with like you. You especially don't want like to use any of the Ken's weapons because they are complete rubbish. Especially the Ken's Splash Off Pro because it has the Booyah Bomb. The Booyah Bomb is the worst special in the game. Did you know how that? And make sure you play as an Octoling because Inklings do not work in Waymaker because the Inklings, um. They just don't like Rainmaker anymore because they saw the Octolings and they all went off. So, your in Inkling will not work in Rainmaker, so you have to play as an Octoling to play Rainmaker. <laughs> you also have to make sure that you are using, um, you do not want to use motion control unless you want to use stick controls with double inverted controls. Otherwise, um, you will not be able to aim properly at anything, um, because without inverted controls, you will be moving your stick to the right, thinking you're aiming to the left, but you'll actually be aiming to the right. You do not want to have that, so make sure you have double inverted controls. No motion controls. Motion controls do not work in Rainmaker. Um, they are only designed for um, private battles. They do not work in any public matches. So make sure you use no motion controls and double inverted controls. You also want your controller to um, be on low battery. As you can tell, my pro controller is on low battery. And it won't work if your battery is too high because then there is no chance of it dying in the middle of the match. And if it dies in the middle of the match, that is the key to winning. You will not win unless your controller would die. So make sure you leave your controller on all night until it gets to low battery. Don't even charge it to it gets above low battery. Keep it on low battery 100% of the time because that's how you, you need it on low battery. Like, you have no way to play unless it's on low battery because you are guaranteed to lose if you're not on low battery. Okay, and you do not want to move, you do not want to move until um, the first 30 seconds of the game are over. So, um, make sure you don't move, and, um, if you're, um, yeah, so you do not want to move, you do not want to leave this area, and you do not want to booyah, you never want to play booyah, don't ever booyah, <laughs> um, because booyahing is bad for your health, so don't booyah, and once for 30 seconds up, you're, um, free to go, and, um, so what you want to do is you never want to um, splat anyone really. Um, but if it's you only want to um, shoot the Rainmaker's barrier, you do not want to splat others because um, splatting others is very mean and they will report you for harassment if you um, splat them. And the only time it's ignore the fact that I do that guys, I'm sorry I hit the button. But do not be on purpose. Um, yeah. So, um, you should be using bamboo sword, as you can see. Um, we are currently um winning, and you are f we are currently losing because yeah. And as you can tell, I did not splat them because that would have um I would have been reported for harassment. Just you do not want to um that anyone you are only allowed to shoot the Rainmaker barrier um but in any other modes besides Rainmaker you are allowed to splat them just in Rainmaker you're not allowed um it's harassment I never help um teams charge up the Booyah Bomb because it's the worst weapon to eat it and you um whenever your teams get the Rainmaker you just want to run away from them and never use your special because um, specials aren't even that good. They are like really bad in this game. Um, Nintendo, they 
so I've changed them from how they worked in Splatoon 1 to how they worked in Splatoon 2. Um, and they do not work as well in this game. Um, they, for some reason, glitch and whenever you use them, um, especially with kind of missiles, like if you use kind of missiles, um, then your game will crash. So yeah, so don't use your specials. Um, as you can see, we have lost, and that was because um, my teammates were using specials. And yeah, so if no one uses specials, guys, you will win. But yeah. Okay, so I will show you these tips um, for real in this match. Um, the last match, I accidentally turned off inverted controls, so. Now, as you can see, um, I have inverted controls on because I am aiming very well. As you can tell, I I have inverted controls on. As you can tell, my aiming has improved greatly. <laughs> so, yeah. So, if you, if you don't have inverted controls, your aiming will not be as good as mine, as you can see. Um, I am very good at aiming right now. Um, due to uh, inverted controls because last time I accidentally turned them off and as you can see I 100% know where I am aiming um, I am not struggling at all as you can tell this is what it should look like um, when you are in A rank battles because you will be super stressed out but this is the correct way to aim as you can tell um, as you can tell, I'm not spraying anyone either, because this is Rainmaker, and um, it's very rude to spat others in this mode. So, yeah. But you also want to um, try to get the Rainmaker, because it is impossible to spat others with that. But except for the barrier. The um, explosion is the only thing that can spot you from the Rainmaker, so if you have the Rainmaker, you will never spot anyone, thankfully, so. So, as you can see, um, it was someone, I was definitely not spotted by the Rainmaker. This is a glitch in the game which says that you were spotted by the Rainmaker when it was someone else who spotted you, so. To not spy anyone, make sure you get the Rainmaker. Um, as you can see, my teammates are doing very badly. They ha do not know any of these tips, so as you can see, that's why we keep losing. But yeah, so, but if you have good teammates that know these tips, you will win every single Rainmaker match that you play. And you will get that X rank. You will get out of that A rank. On both of your accounts, if you have multiple, um, you will not go like you will 100% not drop down to C rank because you keep losing if you get the good teammates. And if you get good teammates, you know what? Find them, do league battles with them because there is Rainmaker and League, obviously. And League is the exact same as ranked, it is not different at all, but you can only play it with friends, not random people. So, yeah. These were some 100% um, real Rainmaker tips, so next time you play Rainmaker on Splatoon 2, use these tips. So remember, use a bamboozler, do not use the rubbish weapons like Dark Shots or Dually, Kent Spot Shot Jr., your, your Optic Shot that you didn't work for at all, your, your Sparrow Shot, your, your blah blah blah, nothing, use nothing but the bamboozler in Rainmaker because all the other weapons are complete rubbish. You also want to use um you also want to only use um gear use one um gear combination that you your first gear combination that you've ever used pretty much besides the basic one. So the first three pieces of gear you purchase for um the head clothes and shoes um those are the only gear that you can use in Rainmaker because they bring you good luck. And yeah, so remember to use um, inverted controls because if you don't, then you will lose. So yeah, th these are 100% real tips. Try them out yourself. You will win every single match as long as your teammates know these tips. So thank you for watching.